when I say Uh-oh. the audacity of some of these people, I mean it. Bad in law poker on your morning show. The best story you went tickets to Olivia Rodrigo. The show is sold out. 877 995 4681 to call. Let me go right off the bat. Let's go. Uh, fake name Jennifer. Good morning, fake name Jennifer. Hi, good morning, guys. So your uh, mother-in-law told you what? So my mother-in-law said at one point that she was tired of sharing my children with my side of the family. Oh, my gosh. I mean, that's how it works. Ew. And fake name Jennifer, when she said that, I mean, did your jaw just drop? I don't even know what you would say back. Um, so it had been through a text and I, I kind of bit my tongue and talked to my husband. Better woman than I am. Please, please speak to your mom before I jump through the phone. Yeah. (laughs) Lord. No. Um, and have, are things better now? Hopefully. Things, yeah, things are okay. Yeah. Um, you know, there's still moments that are similar like that, that come up, but, uh, they get handled. I mean, <laughs> Thank that, goodness. But my that, God. That's just, it's just funny because like. You can't, like, what are you thinking? But also it's like, yeah, that's how it works though. Yeah, like, that's also right. that There's, side of the family's yeah. family. Yeah. Like, um, okay. What? Everybody's family. Yes. Right. Yes. Learn okay. to share, uh, madam. Fake name Jennifer, hold on one second. You were <laughs> in the running. Let me go. Oh, this is kind of funny. Uh, fake name Stephanie, good morning. Good morning. Do we think this wasn't done intentionally or do we think they were just uh, very unaware? No, this was done very intentionally to the point that it still haunts me. Okay, so what what happened? So we were getting ready for my birthday because it's not around anyone else's birthday. And everyone had asked me what I wanted. Well, I had just gotten a new motorcycle, and I was like, okay, anything that's helped with the motorcycle brand. Yeah. So I go over my in house to open presents and do cake with them because it's COVID, so we were doing it at their house. Sure. Well, my boyfriend had not prepared me, and his entire family sat down. His brother was there, their kids were there, his parents were there, and they, his parents gave me their gift, and as I was opening it, there was just lacy underwear and bras, and I don't know if I'm more mortified than lacy. So to wear that kind of stuff. Yeah. Or yeah. that they were my size. Ooh. So, and like, I they know did that research I gave them a key to my place. Yeah. Well, I gave them a key to my place, and they go over there often. And I just thought that it was because, like, they walk past my house when they do their daily walks, and they just wanted to stop by. But I'm typically not home when they stop by. Oh wait, God. so wait, Faith and Stephanie, you think your your in laws went and like measured your underwear and then got you new pairs? <laughs> yes. And I I cannot confirm it, but my boyfriend said after I'd opened these into my ear, you'll look great in these. Like I don't already have a good pair of underwear. Oh my, and then my gosh. Oh my God. Looked at me like they they've been wanting for us to try for a baby. Oh, yeah. that's oh no. my god! So like, okay, okay, you're like gonna they're get... trying to intervene. Yeah, you're gonna get sexy no. time and be thinking about them. Yes, what? that's uh, okay. Um, oh my, to wear them. Yeah, yeah no. Uh, okay, thank you, th- 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 Stephanie Hall. One second, you were in the running as well. Um, that that's a that's a, <laughs> how do you top that lot. one? <laughs> okay, well you can do it this way. Let me go to uh, fake name Brittany and voice change. Good morning, fake name Brittany. Hi, how are you? I'm doing well. So your in-laws did what, fake name Brittany? Well, I have been waiting for a moment to actually share this story. So my in-laws went and got my daughter's ears pierced without my permission, and uh-uh. then they tried to pull it off. And I mean, oh, the good news is, gracious. fake name Brittany, I'm sure your daughter was old enough to make her own decision at this time, right? Oh. No, she was two. Two? Oh, Lord have mercy, I would throw down. I know. And so they tried to say that it was my birthday gift and my surprise, but I was like, that was the first moment. No, ma'am. Yeah, that's what makes it worse. It's not only did you, like, pierce my child without my permission, but you took away a moment from me that I'll never get back. Nope. Nope. And nope. Um, Fake name Brittany. Now, did um, when you told your person uh, about this, did was he upset or did he not quite understand? He 
said he was part of it. No. <laughs> Oh, he in trouble? What an idiot. Not, not, uh, yeah, not, not the way we want to go, right? Yeah, not at all. Okay. Aye, aye, aye. Um, fake name Brittany. Hold on one second. You were in the running as well. Fake name Rachel. Good morning. Hey. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing well. And I your face right now. cannot believe this happened. So your hand for bad in love poker is what? Fake name Rachel. I got married a few years ago, mm-hmm. and when I went to do the food tasting, I invited my in-laws, and they love the venue. It's, of course, gorgeous. And no more than two weeks later, my husband's sister wanted to go to the same, wanted to sign up to go to the same venue, and she did. And before she even asked me if it was okay, they had already put the deposit <gasps> out. So what was I supposed to say when... Um, like she asked me if I cared. Of course I cared. Yeah. They were just it down. So what was I supposed to do? Oh my so god. So your uh, in law, then your sister in law got married at your venue. How well, how long apart? Oh. It was a few years ago. How long was it? It was a few years ago. Mm. But, but but what was like the um the space between both weddings though? Um, it was nine months apart. Wow. People make like weddings make people crazy, man. You cannot do that. Yes. Like, and there's so much it, money invested in weddings, and you put so much thought into having your own special place, and then family's going to go do that? Ay, ay, ay. Mm-hmm. That, that, uh, yeah. N- no. yeah. And by the way, Fagan and Rachel, so did your did your uh, husband, did he think also, yeah, this is a little messed up? Or is he like, nah, do I know what? It's, it's whatever. Oh, yeah. He completely thought it was messed up, but... The way his parents are, we were just like, you know what, screw it. Our wedding was first. It was the best day ever. Sure. And- yeah. Well, no. Well, yep. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you're hold so on. sweet. Fake name Rachel, <laughs> you are in the running as well. I could not uh, imagine that. A lot of texts coming in. My sister in law cut my son's hair. It was his first <gasps> haircut. Oh, God. That made me gasp. Mm-hmm. Like, you don't touch the hair. That's another one of those memories. Mm-hmm. Like, you'll never get that back. Uh, my ex mother in law used to tell my ex fiance to leave me and find somebody better. Uh, my oh, mother-in-law geez. told me I could not look better than her, so she would constantly want to join me at the gym and try hard to outdo me. That's strange. That is That's like, like next level what weird. in the hell? Um, uh, uh, um, uh, okay. Oh, at the time for the uh, jail one, our daughter was three. They were supposed to babysit and go to the park. They took her to the jail instead. Uh, There's a lot of votes coming in, though, over tax 99338. Stephanie with the with the underwear gift. Stephanie, you are the oh, winner. Yeah, uh, you're right. over text. <laughs> oh, well, my God. Go. I kind of don't want to be the winner. Yes. Point, but I mean. Well, you know, now, next time you see the in laws, <laughs> hey, thanks for the undies and the Libra Rodrigo tickets. <laughs> <laughs> so, well, I thank you guys. No. I mean, I, this is the first thing that's happened good all year. Um, obviously, the underwear thing was not very good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> No, no, I get that. Uh, fake name Stephanie. Have a great time with the show. Okay, I'm going to put you on hold for just one second.